Hey guys, what's up? This is Chani SK, SAP FICO as for HANA Finance and MM China. If you are completely new to this channel and watching my videos first time, please subscribe right now and hit the bell icon. Let's move on to the topic. Yes, today concept is SAP Fury. So SAP Fury is just like user interface or user experience that uh, supplements and can replace SAP GUI. GA stands for Graphical User Interface. SAP Fury is just like apps was introduced by SAP a few years back. It's not completely new concept. And right now the version of SAP Fury apps is SAP 3.0. Uh, right now we are using the version is SAP Fury 2.0 in normal systems, in normal practice systems. See, so these apps we can see directly in the mobiles and laptops or any other device. Um, see that uh, that embedded with client network so guys uh, so this apps makes your work very simply simplified for end user perspective this apps has been introduced see here sap customers can use this ux and various solutions and such as sap s4 hana sap success factors employee central sap ariba sap cloud for customers and many more so this apps can be used for um, SAP S4 HANA and we can also apply these apps in S4 HANA, SAP Success Factor, Employee Center, SAP Ariba and SAP Cloud for customers. So the streamlined application can use titles, sorry, tiles to encapsulate standard tasks such as approving purchase requests, viewing sales orders and approving timesheets. So these apps introduced because to approving many more uh, applications in SAP side. So here so you can also approve purchase requisitions and you can also view in the sales order data and you can also post the invoices and you can also create purchase orders and approving timesheets and many more many more things are that we can see in the sap fury apps the reason behind implementing this sap fury apps in the sap system or integrating sap system is just like so to reduce the user work the main reason is to reduce the user work and time so users report increased productivity with Fury apps and the research reveals that the Fury apps develop 64% reduction in time needed to complete a task compared to SAP GUI. So for ECC versions we have SAP GUI is the presentation layer but in S4 HANA so SAP Fury is the first layer that is the presentation layer is just like SAP Fury apps it is the front end layer and after introduction of these fury apps can reduce your work very simplified and easier and it's a very easy to learn this concept there is no complex to learn see guys after taking uh, 30 minutes of trying uh, training you can get it uh, this uh, this work easily and employees also tend to get less frustrated with these fury apps what are the prerequisites that uh, we have to learn in sap fury apps so here uh, for implementing this concept, uh, some of the prerequisites are so provided over here. The following are the requirements for learning SAP Fury apps, ABAP program and objects, and HTML5, JavaScripts, and SAP UI5 ERP implementation experience, and OData and SAP NetFever Gateway, and SAP HANA. Actually, there are, there are some uh, few Fury apps consultants will be recruited by uh, our companies, so they will implement uh, this concept. So as a functional consultant, whatever the basic configurations or integrations are required for this Fury apps that we need to do it from our side. So what are the main apps that is associated with the SAP Fury concept here? Some of the apps like transactional apps and fact sheet and analytical apps. So what is transactional apps and fact sheets and analytical apps? I will explain in the next slideshow. See guys, this is all about SAP Fury apps. If you are completely new to this channel and watching my videos first time, please subscribe right now and hit the bell icon so you will come to know many, many more videos which are very vital for you. Thank you so much for your support.